Hi there, I'm Isabel Marcone, and I'm from Cooper City High School. This is my documentary for the Film de Brard for Latterdale International Film Festival competition. This documentary is about Tuan Russell and his foundation for education. Hope you guys enjoy. Shortcut. Do documentary. How do you measure success? Is it the number of cards a person has? The money in their bank account? The number of followers they have on social media? For Tuan Russell, the answer was not found on the fields of UM and the NFL, but in the bright young minds of the future generations. Sparked by the encouragement of his mother, Tuan Russell founded the Russell Education Foundation. My mom was a school teacher of 30 years. Uh, she taught at Larda Lakes Middle School. Prior to that, she taught at Attics. Uh, middle school. So she taught for actually over 30 years, but she was in uh, Dade County, I mean Broward County School Board for 30 years. She was a science teacher, but she felt that if children could read, they could apply themselves in science or math or English. And it was a big deal in our house. Um, she, you know, she had four boys and she worked all day long, but she still forced us to read as much as we could and do our homework. And reading was a big part of what we did on a daily basis. Although reading and education was top priority in the Russell household, Twan excelled in sports. I don't think she knew that, I don't think anyone knew that I was going to be, you know, an NFL football player. It's one of those things like I had been playing football from five years old. So to sit down at that table and sign a contract at the Redskins, I mean, it was amazing. While most rookies in the NFL are worried about making the team, Twan spent the early part of his career thinking of how best to give back to the community. I, I remember the off season, me and my mom were sitting at the kitchen table and we were talking about doing something special. And I said, Mom, what do you want to do? She says, you know, what about literacy? I said, okay. So we came up with a name, Russell Education Foundation. And we started in a, in a church, a very small church that we were going to. And we would have like 10 kids coming. All we would do is help them with homework. The problem was when you write the instructions down on paper, there was this confusion or this block that was happening. So we focused on reading and comprehension, but we felt if we could teach a child how to read, they can do anything that they want in the world. And we changed our model from a homework model to a literacy foundation where we focus on comprehension, phonetics, reading structure, writing, and our goal was by third grade to make sure every student in our, in our program was a proficient reader. From its humble beginning, the foundation became a huge success. As the number of locations expanded, so did the foundation's philosophy. We believe that every child is created to do something special, down to their DNA, that God makes us very unique. And all we have to do, our part of it, is that we have to challenge ourselves and maximize our DNA, maximize our ability. And the way you do that is by reading, is by educating yourself. And once you get that education, you can apply it into any aspect of your life and you can be exactly who God wants you to be. It is said that a single act of kindness echoes through eternity. The Russell Education Foundation is more than a legacy. For thousands of students, it's a passport to a brighter future.